Off you go, you twat. We live in modern times. Drones, robots, computer control, they all have their place. But so do people. And that place is us. Because when you need help, you need the human touch. Not robots, not soldiers, just people like you. The Metropolitan Police. People protecting people. If we're lucky, word hasn't spread that you've hung up your jackboots. Just try to put on your meek, harmless, broken by the system face. Oh, and don't forget your uniform.
looking sharp. Your ex-colleagues won't pay any attention to you unless you let them take a close look. Is that the new height? Caution, now we're inside. Any disturbance in here and Nigel Cass will surely cancel his meeting. Avoid being detected by your former colleagues or this operation is a bust. Standard quadrant search, go. Nigel won't have anything important on this floor. You seem to know an awful lot about him. Yeah, I was Albion too, if you hadn't twigged to that. Me and Cass were close ones. Looked up to him. Huh. He was bigger than life, fam. Literally a tech genius. And I was just a gearhead kid. I wanted to be like him. That's why I joined up. Seriously? Didn't find out he was a murderous prick until later. Can't wait to see it roll out. This is going to make our jobs that much easier and safer. Yeah. You don't think it's going to make certain uh, aspects of our job redundant, do you? They're escaped. We need to regroup. The past takes care of his own. You know that. Fair point. Schedule, and Mr. Cass is as determined as ever to make the White Tower as safe as possible from terrorist attacks. I believe he has ensured that every security measure has been taken so that we have someone high on the left and take the right. I don't think there's a position. I don't know what's going on. 
the end of construction. End of the day, I think it's a shit. It's shit. I can't stand there and watch him just be a bunch of overbearing. I heard someone saying dead sick was just sick of They better not be just a bunch of terrorists pretending to have morals. This door clearly requires a security pass. Brill. Use one of the nearby computers to create your forgery. Be careful. You don't want to know what Nigel does with trespassers. I'm wondering why we're not being sent out against those fucking You've been up there yet? There are some parts of this city that need a good work in water with some I spend people. too much time online. You understand? Yeah, yeah I know what you mean. But there's always an element that's going to resist all. Sure, I don't want to be taking care of them. No, no. You mean dead? I've heard some talk on the street that they may be back in operation. It'll take some time for the forgery to be ready. To keep you occupied, I dragged up still images and a recording from an internal investigation into Cassini's death. Let's see it. Internal Psych Assessment AS001 Subject Cass Nigel. Mr. Cass experienced a deeply traumatic event when he witnessed the murder of his father, Gareth Cass, CEO of Albion. He began exhibiting symptoms soon after what he frequently described as the random event. Mr. Cass's initial symptoms included insomnia, paranoia, distorted blame, and recurring flashbacks. However, he appears to have channeled his anger and self-described powerlessness into his work to ensure that Albion become, quote, a mechanism for preventing unpredictable violence. It seems somewhat of a mania edging on psychosis. For me, this raises concerns about Mr. Cass's fitness to run a multinational security company. But I cannot, at this time, make any recommendation beyond continued monitoring, especially considering that I have been asked to close this file. Oh, wow. I almost feel sorry for him. But maybe he should have gone through therapy instead of being put in charge of securing London. Yeah, well... Nigel's never close to anyone but his dad. And me, I guess. Never had much faith in people, really. Well, the pass is ready, but rough. If this resistance thing doesn't work out, I doubt you'll make a living as a document forger. Let's give it a go anyway. Nigel Cass awaits. Welcome to Project Themis, our new autonomous drones. These drones can identify, isolate, and terminate threats before they can do harm. They can go anywhere, see everything. They could kill a man alone in an alley or in a crowd of hundreds with perfect precision. Themis drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Act 
immediately and decisively. Without your support, I couldn't stand here and tell you. And I promise you that with the launch of Project Emis, London will be the first city in the world to be made truly safe. Mr. Cass, I was hoping you'd called us all in here today to discuss the ethical issues. <laughs> no, it's all right. The Commissioner cares, as we all do. I admire his, his passion and his dedication. Let's talk ethics. Well, for one, Themis goes far beyond Albion's mandate. We really should have more government consultation. I see. Delay the launch so that we can debate and assess the details. We're missing the human element here. I can get the Defence Minister on the line right now. Well, if you feel you must. into this. No more debate, delay, indecision. Understand this. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. Now, will our friends at Tidus be ready? You are the cornerstone of the project after all. Do you need to consult any outside parties? Uh, no. We'll be ready. And just in time. Criminals running our streets. Illegals threatening our families. The police commissioner himself. Assassinated by terrorists. Decisiveness is hard. But here's the best part. Once this decision is made, no more will be required of you. Attention, a building-wide security sweep has been initiated due to dock breach. I warned you about that, forgery. Your uniform will help. Don't let them get a close look at you. How do I get out of here, Bags? The catacombs, fam. Yes, before. Shit, 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 shit! 
You're an action in there, didn't you? Man can be very uh, persuasive. Sounds like he plans to launch Themis ASAP. And from the way he was talking, I don't think it's a sort of genie that goes back into the bottle. this at all. Albion's top secret project is an automated killing machine. And it looks like Cass is almost ready to launch. We have to get Themis out of his hands. I'll prepare a briefing. Will we see you there, Hamish? Pretty face, not risking, remember? But patch me in. You and me got some scheming to do, Bagley. whenever you're ready.
here's what we know about Nigel Cass. He's rolling out something called Project Themis. The lack of information on its own is worrisome, but what little we do know is Cass wishes to remove the human element from law enforcement. We also know he's partnered with Titus, which is never good. Titus does other work with Albion. Nasty shit like autonomous weapons, human targeting algorithms. So Titus is our best lead to fill in the blanks on the secret project, but their security is notoriously difficult to crack. So Hamish has proposed an intriguing solution. Albion's been working on a new microdrone, something my contact told me about. That shit's not even in production yet, but if we get the plans, we can manufacture our own. To get around Titus security? Exactly, exactly. They're weird as fuck. Supposed to do maintenance on Albion's other drones, but the smallness of them means they can slip into places nothing else can. Well, there we have it. Our next step is to infiltrate the Albion drone manufacturing lab and get our hands on schematics. And then you lot will have a fun little gadget to break in the Titus. Love it. I'll shoot you the location. Be careful. Albion doesn't like to share his toys.